I'm John Tatulis from Sound Devices. The 688, we've also added the ability to scan RF receivers that are attached to the SL6. The SL6 is our additional accessory piece that bolts onto the 688, accepts super slot or uni-slot compatible wireless receivers, and with receivers that are compatible with our scan function, the SRB and the SRC and the WYSICOM presently, right from the 688 I can initiate a scan and I can deploy a frequency on those receivers. And uh, what's the benefit of that? The benefit is that you've got this nice big screen and you've got these nice big controls and now you've got one environment to deploy those frequencies to multiple receivers. To get into the wireless receiver and control of that, a shortcut is hitting the meter button and then hitting the headphone encoder. And now this is the receiver overview. Right now there's only a single receiver attached. But we can get into that specific receiver and we can go into the menu selections of this receiver and do any control of the menu directly on the 688 here. But we can get back out into this. We can initiate an RF scan directly from the 688. So now it's doing an RF frequency sweep. Now there's no antennas onto here, so the scan won't be particularly valid. But when the scan is complete, we can select a frequency and highlight a frequency and we can de deploy that directly to that receiver or any of the receivers that are attached to the SL6. So you're seeing two sides of, of, its, rec of its receiver doing the sweep. So now we can take a frequency, we can select that and then we can move that to that specific receiver side. So we deploy it, assign the frequency, and now it's been assigned. Intermod products among frequencies are part of the calculation that the SL6 is making to make for compatible frequencies. Beautiful.